Welcome. Welcome back everyone. Welcome. Thank you for joining me for our latest video. And I've had a few people commenting saying that they want an overview of the mini lead again. So I think we maybe did the last overview in December and a few things have actually come along. You can see we've got the range chest been tempered to level 3 and that is so we have 75% upkeep. So that we've only got to hit a 25% weekly upkeep boost thingy, which is cool. Um, so yeah, we're doing very well. Now with food positive, it means that I can try and keep more food in the bags. The Kung Fu Panda skin looks so cool. I'm loving it. It looks so cool. Um, so let's start off with the research. Thank you for being here, by the way. Please do hit that like button. And I'm sorry if it's something you've seen before, I just get a lot of requests for it, so I figured we'd have a little update of the uh, mini lead. So, quickly we'll just go through the research, then we'll go into the familiars and heroes and whatnot, and then we'll get into the blast sets, because some progress has been made. So Monster Hunt down to level 4, actually on the way to level 5, we've got some good Monster Hunt research. No upgrade defenses, upgrade military down to the third, uh, the fifth quick swap and the third battalion thing. And uh, yeah, quite far away from maxing that out, I don't think we'll ever need to. We've got the, uh, the army leadership down to the wedges and I don't really think we'll ever be going any further than that. And then military command, we've got down to obviously so we can mythic things. Familiars, we have actually unlocked packed 3 and I don't think we will be unlocking packed 4. And that is because packed 4 is a lot of research might. I don't think we're ever going to want to do that. Um, sigils, nothing done there. Wonder battles of course, nothing there. T5, we've only gone down to get the two battalions but... I don't really think I ever want T5 on the mini lead because, man, this game is expensive enough without T5 when Char Char plays it the way he does. So I don't know if it's a good idea having T5 on the mini lead. Um, the Lunite is so expensive. So let's go into the familiars. We've, of course, got the Rabbit. Oh, Army Max HP. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So we've got, of course, the Bunny. Um, level 10. We've of course got the Blackwing. Level 10. Oh, more army, more more army HP and the Hellfire, of course. Um, we'll work on that one day. We've got, of course, the Bon. Level 10. Love to see it. Love to see it. We have got the Garg maxed at level 10. So we've got the Bon, the Bunny, the Garg, and the Blackwing. Got a few other stackers as well. And then if we go out into here, you can see we are working on the Queen Bee and the Frostwing. The Queen Bee is 80 out of 200. Not bad. Just slow rolling that bad boy. And the same with the Frostwing. It's 72 out of 200. So not bad. They're on their way. Just recently, Trez bought his first Jade, wor uh, Jade Worm pack thing. So big rip there. But love to see it. And then moving on into the heroes quickly, we have got the Chronicler on our way, 60 out of 150, really, really close now. The Magma is being slow rolled when the packs come out, same as the Necro Duke. And uh, yeah, we've got all of the Coalition heroes are gold, we've got Don Guapo, Snail Princess, um, and there's one more. Cursed Hunter, yeah. So they are all gold, that's an extra 200,000 each, that's pretty cool. Um, what else have we got to look at? We'll just have a quick look at the battalions. We have got the Imp. We have got the Range. We have got the Cav. Nice. I'm not sure if that's actually set up, it looks like it is. And we've got 442. Which I don't really use, I'm not really a big Fort fan, but... So we'll just have a quick look through the cabinet before we dive... Then we've got the Orb of Pestilence, yeah! Yeah, baby, let's go! Love that Orb, love that Orb! And then we've, we're working on this sixth cup to Mythic, absolutely savage. Slowly but surely tempering the drums. 
Um, obviously, I've had a little play with the worm rod as well. Um, so let's do it, guys. Let's let's without any further ado. This is probably the most exciting part of the video. We are in range talents right now. This range gear has come a long way. This. When I was a mini lead at 200 mil, range used to be my favourite stat at about 700%. I was going crazy with it. Now it's 830.9. Pretty much 831% with 424% army HP. No fort. That is, uh, that is pretty nice. Pretty damn nice. So let's have a look now at Le Cav. Ponies, unicorns. This is good as well. 802.8%. 422.5 army HP. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Cav, baby. Look at. Oh, yeah. So, it's come a long way. It's come a very long way since the solo trapping days. And then we will go, uh, of course, Imp. Let's have a little looky. Eight hundred and sixty-three percent. So with the four, that will be eight hundred and eighty-eight percent. And we are actually going to get the Terra Lash rock in once it is. Um, we're just slow rolling it. It's not something we really need to rush. I think it's an extra three point five percent. We'll add this in instead of the saw, and then we'll slowly temper that as well. Cause it's level fifty-five. The level 55 pieces, level 50 pieces are a little bit easier to temper. Um, so yeah, that's about it. I guess we can have a quick look at the mix set. Let's have a quickie on that. Oh yeah, right. Okay. So I actually disagree a little bit. I like to put in the... I like to do this. I like to put in an Imp Heavy piece and a Cav Heavy piece take away the army hp things but uh, i like that for a bit of mixed gear but you know it lowers the hp a bit 468 percent and then when we go back to what it was originally i think this is why we have it uh yeah so originally it's 549 percent with the cab a little bit low for me at 391 <clears throat> but the range and inf is very high so probably that is how it should be i just like having it with that and that in because it's cool to see that I can have a mix set where the imp is like over 600% the range is over 500 and the cab is also over 500 and the army HP is still pretty good so I don't know if I felt like it was a cab rally I would probably probably go with that but I know it's you know I'm probably being dumb and I don't know what I'm talking about but anyway just before we go let's open up these packs let's do that Okay, so we got one extra one there. We got one, two Astrolite. That's cool. Let's do them individually. I got one Astrolite. One Astrolite. One Astrolite. Wait, is it going to show me individually? One Astrolite. There you go. One Astrolite times two. Let's just do these five now. And boom. Nice. Nice. That means we got one five. Dude, that was nice. That was... like. That was nice. Open five chests and get ten. That's like two out of each chest. Dude, that was really good. That was really good. Holy, holy, holy IGG. Let's go. Okay, so we have 22. Do I want to gamble again? Not really. Not really. I want an extra range percent. I don't know why I've got into the worm rod, tempering the worm rod, but I'm really into it. I'm really into it. I can't help it. I'm sorry, Trez. Right, so what is it now? Hmm. Okay, we got 14 left. Okay, okay, okay. I think we go for another drum then. Oh yeah, we'll do both of the drums. Look at that, perfecto. Get that one to level 7. And we will get that one also to level 7. So not feeling fruity with any gambles today, but for, to get so much Astrolite out of 13 chests, 22 Astrolite out of 13 chests, that's pretty good. So I'm quite happy with that. And there you go, we've seen the Worm Rod and two more Drum upgrades. That's pretty nice. So it's just uh, for science. It was 803%, should now be 804 
Yeah, 804, almost 805, nice. And then the range will be up another 1% as well. Love to see it. Love to see it, guys. Love to see it. Just little increases here and there. There you go. Almost 832%. Let's go. Okay, cool. Thank you for having me, guys. Um, just before we go... Oh, God, this has been a long video. My bad, guys. I've been waffling away. My bad. Um, just before we go, don't forget about the deals from Huawei. It's not the New Year offer anymore. It is a different one for that, but it's still, uh, it's pretty much the same offer. It's really, really good offer as well, again. And, of course, if you're spending money on Lords, you may as well be saving money when you are spending money on Lords. So, make sure you download Huawei App Gallery. Make sure you've got the reward center as well, so you can see your loyalty reward level. Don't forget, as you spend money, you will build that loyalty reward level up, and then you will get better discounts, bigger discounts in the future, as your level goes up and more coupons and stuff daily coupons and whatnot so i hope you guys enjoy that um yeah don't forget about huawei app gallery and thank you very much for this slightly long overview video we did a couple of upgrades at the end and uh yeah i'll probably be on a live stream later or something so i will see you all then please do like and subscribe i will uh see you in the next one i love you all goodbye be safe bye now see you soon